You're going to find this hard to believe, but I believe in voodoo. Well, voodoo choppers. Voodoo Choppers in Clinton Township is where people from around the world come when they want a one-of-a-kind custom-built chopper. And Eric Gorgeous is the man they see to make it happen. He combines art, metal, motion, and mechanics to make motorcycles that, well, make a statement. Seriously, how cool is it when people ask you what you do for a living, you get to say, I build choppers. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Because it's one of those things like, you know, not a lot of people have that for an answer, so. Well, yeah, you're the first guy I ever met that made choppers. When did, were you like in dental school and like the second year in you said, you know what, I'm gonna make choppers. Yeah, well, it wasn't dental school per se, it was um, rocket science school. But now I, uh, I was in IT for quite some time and always loved working with my hands, started working with my hands when I was a kid. And it wasn't that I didn't like doing what I did. Yeah. But I wanted to do something that fed my soul at the same time, you know, and it was just one of those things. Yeah, you know, with our show, we just feed ourselves. We don't worry about our souls. We're just always, <laughs> we're just always eating. Yeah. What's the first thing you have to learn if you're going to be a chopper builder? Obviously, you want to understand the mechanics of a motorcycle. Right. You know, right. so that's probably the most important thing. Right. Is, Distance go up and down, yeah, wheels you know, go round and round. How, okay. how yeah. a bike works and how it operates yeah. and all that stuff. But then you also sort of want to know, outside of the whole fabbing, of it, yeah. how to build it. You, you want to know how to read the person too. Well, and shaping metal, I mean, did you learn that from Yuri Geller? I mean, how did you learn how to bend and shape metal? I, I found a guy locally who's like one of the best in the States and apprenticed with him for a while to learn how to shape metal. What's a typical day like for you? Do you come in? I mean, there's a lot of bikes in here. Are you working on many at one time or just one at a time? Um, it depends. Usually I have a couple different projects. Sometimes I get jostled around a little bit. But the reason I work on more than one at a time is because sometimes I'll get blocked a little bit creatively. Yeah. So I might be working on one area and I might not fully see it. And I don't want to start things before I fully see it in my mind's eye. So I'll go work on something else for a while and then come back to it. Quick question, why is Southeast Michigan a good place for you to be with your business? It's Detroit, man. It's the Motor City, you know? Everything's here. It's awesome. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like if you're into manufacturing, you're into making things, hot riding, motorcycles, whatever, Detroit's the place to be. Could you show me how to make a chopper? Why don't we just start with some basics? Basics are good. Well, you know me, I'll try anything twice. But lucky for Eric, I'll probably only try this once. Yes. Hello, ladies. Okay, Eric, dude, I'm ready for you. Whoa, whoa, ease up, cowboy. You don't need all that just yet. Turn it! Well, sometimes I'm just too cool for myself. Thanks for the smock, dude. At least let me keep that on. Oh, you need something. Thanks. Uh, so this is metal that you bent. Yeah. So, so, what, what kind of metal is that? Yeah. So this is just mild steel. It's uh, it's 18 gauge. This one's already shaped a little bit, so it's mm. got a little bit of a bowl shape to it. Right. And this is one of the most important machines in my shop here for shaping metal. Sounds like a good place to start. Hold on, I, I can do this. Okay. Yep. Pretty much just like that. Uh, that went well, I think. Oh, you dented it. Oh, shoot, I dented your bended metal. Well, I told you I did dent in metal. Well, you did a good job. Thanks. So you think I could be an apprentice here? For sure. Yeah. I'll, uh, I'll find you a new broom. The broom. So if you're into making a statement on the highway, get a hold of Eric Gorgeous at Voodoo Chopper and let him do that voodoo only he do so well. As for me, I'm making progress. Eric? Eric? Eric?